Wait! Wait! <laughs> <laughs> Aloha everyone, welcome to our second day at Aulani. It's our first full day. Today, David and I are going to Makahiki for breakfast. Right now it's 5.15 in the morning. David's still asleep. I just wanted to get up a little bit early so I could see maybe, not the sunrise because it doesn't come over on this side, but some early morning photos around the beach and in the lobby and then breakfast a little bit later. It's amazing, the music in the elevators is Disney music, but it's sung in Hawaiian. I love quiet mornings at Disney Resort and Aulani is no different. So the question of the day, what time did I get up? I was up at about 4.45, just because, you know, I'm still a little bit jet lagged, but that's not too bad for me. 4.45 compared to basically 2.45 when we were back in San Francisco. So I'm getting used to it. Still too early for the shops. They open at 7 a.m. It's about 5.15, so I think I'm basically alone here. I just can't get over this resort. It's just so beautiful. This resort is unbelievably beautiful. I'm using the light here so you can see me just a little bit, but you can see all of the stars at night. No light pollution in Hawaii. It is beautiful. And the resort has kind of this orange glow throughout it. It is an absolutely beautiful place, day or night. Good morning, David. It is bright and early. We're both up a little bit early. David, did you sleep well though? Yes, very well. So not as jet lagged. We're getting used to it. Yep. One more night. And we'll be all Good. set. Perfect. And now we're getting a refill of our resort refillable mugs, and then we'll have breakfast bright and early. As we're making our way to the refill station, we just we can't help it. We can't, can you blame us though? Look at this. Look at this resort. No, well, no jumping from, no jumping or diving from the bridge. That seems like an important rule. But the the attention to detail, the beauty throughout this resort is unparalleled. It's not open as you can see by the rope right next to me here, but take a look at the adult only jacuzzi infinity pool right there. This is a spot that Dave and I were at yesterday, but look at the color. I'm just, I'm just so blown away by the attention to detail everywhere. Yes, you have the, the orangish colors in the ground and that goes to the blue and then it just goes right into, it looks like it goes right into the ocean. This place is themed unbelievably. This is the Oleo Room. David and I are planning on checking this out a little bit later. It's not open yet, but I'm just taking a few photos. They have the alphabet right here. Very cool lit up bar right there. And a couple sculptures right there with their Hawaiian names. This place is amazingly themed as well. We're gonna be eating breakfast here in just a little bit. You can already smell it. It, smell, it doesn't smell amazing. It smells it delicious. amazing already. But look at the paintings on the wall. Absolutely beautiful. And in the actual dining room, because this is where you pick up the buffet, in the dining room, look. Look at this. It's the gla like blown glass sculptures all around. They have seating inside and outside, but you can imagine the temperature is just perfect for both. David, are you excited? Oh yeah. Here we go. Here's another view of this veranda again, and now with the light around, you can see, oh my gosh, what, what a view we have here. This is unbelievable. a refill of our resort refillable mugs and now we're just gonna relax. This vacation is unlike other vacations I've been on before. After relaxing here with the most amazing view you can possibly imagine. Look at that. I mean, it's just unbelievable. We're gonna go ahead, go back upstairs, get dressed and ready for breakfast at Makahiki with all of those characters. Look at this. There's Makahiki right there and there's Minnie in a Hawaiian outfit right there. You can hardly see her, but don't worry. We'll get a closer view once we go in. Look at the line all ready for that meet and greet with Mickey right there. For those who have a reservation at Makahiki, we're gonna go upstairs, change really fast and go stand in line. Look at the crowds already and it's not even 7.30. Time for breakfast. Take a look at our attire here. I love this shirt, and David's shirt has a very special Mickey Hawaiian one on as well. And by David's suggestion, we have our beads back on, which I think really does add. Time is now 7.43, so we are right on time, but there is about, what, 30, 40 people ahead of us to meet Mickey? Well worth that picture. Happy birthday, David. Celebrating David's birthday. Mickey, how are you? Aloha, good to see you. How are you doing? Hawaii, first time ever. It's our second full day. We're having a lot of fun. Nice. 
Oh, thank you. Birthday. Yeah. Always love meeting Mickey, and that outfit was awesome. Time for breakfast. Are you hungry, David? Oh, yeah. I'm starved. Hi, Minnie. Love your outfit. See you soon. Oh, thank you very much. Appreciate it. See you soon. Okay, we made it to our table in Makahiki. Let's get food. Let's oh, do it. my gosh. It all looks delicious. Types of meat here, eggs Benedict. Got the uh, paella, that's like fried rice, some fish here, some potatoes. I'm gonna try it all. Okay, there's maple syrup, which I love, but there's also coconut syrup. I feel like since I'm here, I've got to try the coconut syrup. I'm putting some on the side of my plate. I have the Hawaiian sweetened toast, red velvet hickory waffle, pancake, and buttermilk biscuit. It's getting a little bit loud in here, as you can tell. Oh, there's Pluto. There's a lot of kids playing with the uh, instruments behind us with Auntie. A little bit on the loud side. The wave going on. We go surfing out there, I can tell. Oh. Happy birthday. I love that collar. Thank you. <laughs> love the collar. See you later. Perfect where we are with the Hawaii. Thank you very much. It's, it's too bad too because it could be amazing, but every single piece of food we have tried has totally underwhelmed us, totally. I, I really want to be honest. I want to be 100% honest when I say you don't need to come here. It's You can get these same similar entertainment, character meetings. It's just not worth it. It's just loud, it's ruckusy, and the food is not very good. I just want to be totally honest with you. You, know, you may love it, that is totally fine. But in my opinion, and I think David shares my opinion here, it's just not worth it. And I, don't, I wouldn't come back for breakfast. I wouldn't come back. Pool time. Off we go. Okay, we're gonna see if we can catch the fish feeding, if it's still available. If not, we'll get that later. And then we're gonna do maybe some slides. Take a look at the fish feeding right there. They put a little thing right there in the tank for the fish to eat. And then we get to see it all right from the window. New day means new wristband. We're doing the tube stone curl. How was it? It's fun? Nice. It's fun. It was great. That's a good slide. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you got the suntan lotion on, right? You're, you're, you're set. We're, we're both set. We're both set. I'm ready to go in. Let's go in. Hey, come on now. We're getting in the water. You're getting all wet too. Oh, you're set. You're set to go. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. My wristbands are getting pretty intense here. Loving that button. Loving that button. Hey, how are you? We're in the adult-only pool. Really well cleaned and nice and quiet. We're gonna go get one of those special flavored dull whips. I saw a guava one that looks amazing. Phenomenal, Emily, thank you so much. Thank you. Aloha. Guava pineapple dull whip swirl. It's really good. Tastes just like one from Adventureland or maybe even the Polynesian Village Resort. There's guava on the bottom. Time for the volcanic vertical. See you down there. Whoa, let's go! Whoa! <laughs> that was awesome! Whoa! Yeah. Are you okay? Oh yeah! That was awesome! Too dark! I mean, too bad! <laughs> now David and I are having so much fun here, but I want to take a moment out of the fun just for a second to talk about Veterans Day. Today is Veterans Day. None of this, none of it, would be possible without the men and women who serve to protect our nation every single day. Today we think of you and thank you for your service. Shelly May is actually a relatively difficult character to catch, and you can tell by the size of this line how many people are interested in seeing her. Cherry, guava, and pineapple is our flavor, and we have ice cream on the bottom, with the Mickey ears, of course. Shelly, how are you? Good to see you. 
trying to keep up with the uh, the melt here of the shave ice, but absolutely delicious with a beautiful view of Alani. Yes, you know, I'm trying to match your style. You got the beads on and everything, though. Thank you very much. Good to see you again. Thank you very much. Pluto's right. just wandering around. I love that. Uh, oh, Scott, I didn't get him. It's so relaxing, and I know what you're thinking. Michael, they've got a lazy river, a typhoon lagoon, and Blizzard Beach. And they do. They do. I'm not, not denying that. I'm not saying that one's better, one's worse. But I'm in Hawaii. I have views, which I'm going to turn around and show you, like this. And when, when you can sit back and you can relax, the ocean's here, and the, the fresh air, and the breeze, and the sun, and the warm, it's just, it's, it's hard to beat it. It's truly hard to beat it. Unmatched. This, I think, is my David, my favorite spot right now. Is there David? Definitely my, fa my favorite spot right now at Alani, uh -huh. the, the Adult Infinity Jacuzzi, looking out onto the water. We're dressed for lunch, and today David's going to pick it. Probably going to be one of those counter service options that we saw. The fish and chips and onion rings, those looked and smelled delicious. Aloha, Donald. How are you? Loving the hat and the shirt. Good to see you. You're, you're clearly number one here in Hawaii. Oh, see? Uh -huh. I was telling Mickey, we got to talk about Donald a little bit. Now we're back inside grabbing our mugs and switching the GoPro camera battery, and then we're going to do something that I thought was so smart. David's idea, he gets all the credit here. In the Infinity Pool Jacuzzi, the hot tub one that we really love, David wants to catch, get this, ready for this? The sunset from within the jacuzzi. How smart is that? Smart guy over here. So we're gonna do that, and first we get lunch though. We're probably gonna try something here from Mama's Snack Shop. One of David's all-time favorite is the fish and chips from England in the World Showcase at Epcot. So we're gonna do a full comparison here with the local style fish and chips. We've got fish and chips and three different sauces here. A sriracha tartar sauce, some wasabi sauce here, and sweet and spicy chili sauce. That is expertly done fish. Expert. I'm impressed. Comparing this to England, you know that's your favorite, fish and chips. Comparing this to that. So something I like about England is the fish is a little bit it's thicker, but it's not quite as uh, dense. Yet uh, the, the, the quality of the fried fish here is just Unbelievable. I, I want to say this is even better. All this food is phenomenal. Overall, David and I are extremely impressed by the fish and chips. The sauces, I think, alone made it just a totally new type of experience. And they even have, even have the menu. This piece of paper right here. Loved it. Absolutely loved it. Next time, instead of makihiki, I'll come here for breakfast. Thank you of the pumpkin dole whip. Yes, all right. We're excited for this dole whip. Pumpkin dole whip. Pumpkin dole whip. What have a teeth? It's a seasonal thing only here at Aulani, but when we heard about this, we had to try it, and I am so glad we did, because I have a feeling we'll be getting more before we leave here. Pumpkin dole whip. Wow. Hey Disney, a uh, little suggestion, bring this to Disney World. It would sell really well, don't worry year about round. it. Year round. Now I know what you're thinking, Michael, compared to Pineapple Dole Whip. I don't think I'd make that comparison. That's not, it's not a fair one, because this is, this is different. It's different. This is a pumpkin taste, a bit of a pineapple taste, completely different things. But I'm telling you, the Pumpkin Dole Whip has its place, absolutely has its place at Disney. No doubt about it. Wow. It's just so good. It's, it's a Dole Whip. Yeah. Not too sweet, perfect like spice flavor. Seated for fire pit storytelling. Myself, one of the caretakers here at Olani, which means most of the time I go around and change my bulbs. And Te Fiti was the mother island. 
And does anybody know anything about Moe? Shapeshifter. Shapeshifter. Very good. Yeah. Moe seems unreasonably attached to his... Magical fish. Very good, very good. Everybody say hi, Moana. Hi, Moana. Mahalo Nui, thanks for joining us. And how about a big hand to Moana? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was good. That was really good. All set for a view with front row seats. Amazing the rainbow of colors that you see in the clouds here from orange to yellow to blue to green. It's incredible. Truly beautiful sunset. Now off for dinner. We're taking a look at the off the hook menu here. And I've got to tell you, I see some things that look delicious to me, like the mahi uh, or Maui onion rings, and several of the uh, the Angus burger and the Kalua pork tacos. Those look especially good. So tonight's dinner may be off the hook. Still deciding, but looks pretty good. So we decided to go with off the hook simply because it's a little bit loud over by the Olio room. Not that we don't like the very nice Hawaiian music. It's beautiful music. They've just turned the volume way too loud for this beautiful music, so off the hook it is. So I'm thinking Maui onion rings. I've heard nothing but good things about that. What else do you want? Tacos, the Kalua pork tacos and the shrimp tacos. I can see why people love it so much. Like, it's like before, it's like, it's a long way to get there. Why bother? You can get the same thing elsewhere. Palm trees, ocean. No. No, there's something special. Have the shrimp tacos right here with the onion rings. Looks absolutely delicious. And David, you have the Kalua pork tacos and french fries. Yeah. First up, the Kalua pork taco. Overall, I think it's pretty good. Nothing to write home about, though. So it's like, you can't go wrong with it. It's not a bad one. But I wouldn't just go out of my way for it. Right. You see it? Feel the same? Totally agree. Not life changing. But it's good. Yep. It's good. Not the best shrimp tacos I've ever had. But not bad. Just handed the dessert menu, and believe it or not, ready for this? They, they have they have the mocha chantilly cake, that amazing best ever chocolate coffee cake I've ever had in my whole life. They have it here at Off the Hook. So if you want to go to Ama Ama, but maybe you just want to get that dessert. Hey, kitty, there's a cat over here. Um, so if you try that one, you love it, you want to get it again, they do have it here at Off the Hook, but I'm, I'm tempted to try something else. I mean, I loved it so much, but I want to give other things a try. Uh, I have a fork. Will you eat half? Um, I don't know about half. Will you commit to a third? Um, I don't know about committing If, if you to can a third. commit to a third, we'll get one. I don't know about commitment to a third. It is currently 8.10 at night. It's relatively early, but you can see the lights are on. Everything looks beautiful. The pools are lit up with like a blue glow. Those little, um, Things right here that are hanging right there, like the lights, those are glowing. I mean, everything around here is beautiful, day or night. To me, it's just amazing what Disney has done. Give us the numbers. Got our refills, and now we're making our way very slowly, taking our time, taking in all the views to uh, maybe a couple of the gift shops inside the resort. Maybe they have Olu back, we'll take a look and some other gifts for friends and family back home. We're taking a look at the Makihiki dinner and it does look extremely good. So I'm very optimistic at Makihiki dinner. Fingers crossed. Crab legs, fish, steak. Checking back for Olu, but he's still not here. As you can see in David's hand, we just did a bunch of shopping thanks to some unbelievably generous friends, Doug and Pam, Leonard and Claudia, Dave, Chris, and Emily. I used all of your gift cards and I cannot thank you enough. Got some amazing mementos and some things to share with family when we get back home. Another spectacular day coming to an end, but it was amazing, wasn't it? Amazing. Magical in every regard. 
Thank you so much for being a part of the magic with us today. It was so much fun to share all of it with you. Tomorrow is another magical day, including the special Disney Luau. Can't wait to share all of that with you. Until then, have an absolutely magical night. See you real soon.